Hello everyone, I'm Jess with Black Travelers Network, where we provide trips that focus on the Black experience and different parts of the world. And we cover exciting news stories that impact the African diaspora. Before I get into today's story, I have to tell you, if you have ever thought about traveling to Brazil, especially if you have thought about traveling with us, we are hosting an online travel event. This event takes place on August 22nd, Saturday, August 22nd, where we will take you to Brazil right from the comfort of your own home. You can look in the video description to get the link to how you can learn more about the online trip. This is a private group travel experience online. And so all I can tell you is that those of you who attend will get more than what you pay to join the experience. The other quick announcement is for those of you who are sitting tidy and but also ready to travel, please be mindful that one of our trips next year in 2021 is to Kenya. And so if you're interested in visiting Kenya in 2021, definitely make sure you send us a message to get more information on how you can join this Kenyan trip. And so now on to today's exciting story. West African cuisine has gained new popularity over the last few years due to the rise of prominent high profile restaurants turning up in major cities across the country and also lots of people traveling to West Africa. I remember visiting West Africa and having some of the most amazing grouper fish and then coming back to the United States and requesting it. People had absolutely no idea what I was talking about. So travel can definitely change your taste buds and your palate. A couple based in Chicago went ahead and took a step further by creating a new line of frozen West African meals that are now available at Whole Foods. Pertit and Fred Spencer are the owners of IO Foods, a small food brand company specializing in traditional West African cuisine. The couple wanted to create a brand that represented the important connection between excellent homemade recipes and family bonding. The frozen meals are available in select Whole Food locations in Texas, Arkansas, Louisiana, Oklahoma, in addition to the Chicago-based grocery store, Green Grocer. The couple hopes that the meals will open more Americans up to trying food from West African countries, seeing the great reception their brand has received. I would also recommend that if your local grocery store does not carry IO frozen foods, there's no harm in requesting it or connecting with the company yourself to see how you can encourage the Whole Foods in your area to make sure they keep IO frozen foods in stock. And this is a prime example as to why travel is so important. You know, the world really does open up and it sparks so much creativity and insight into what are some needs that exist in this world. And if you can fulfill some of those needs, my goodness, you are not only on a pathway to wealth, but you're also on an amazing pathway to creating a real life of freedom. And so I'm so excited to be able to share this story with you guys. And I encourage all of you to prepare to travel. Now is the time where you should be financially preparing yourself and physically preparing yourself to travel. The world is still somewhat on lockdown. And I only say somewhat on lockdown because there are a lot of countries that have opened up and that are opening up to international travel. And so it's only a matter of time where people will begin to go back and forth and engaging in international travel. And that's why I tell you, now is the time for you to prepare yourself to travel. Thank you guys so much for listening. 
And until next time.